The bond you share is a rarity, and its fruits more valuable than any precious metal or stone. Marriage, of course, is more than a formal exchange of rings. It is a sacred and solemn promise to one another that no matter what, you're in this together. <laughs> what took some time right there? All this. May the ceremony provide you with wonderful memories to look back on and treasure for the rest of your days. Who gives this bride to be married today? Me and, me, me and the boys. <laughs> Shania? <laughs> As you stand here today before God, realize that you are preparing to celebrate one of life's greatest gifts the depths of which you have only begun to explore. Your level of love and commitment is something that many seek, but not everyone finds. The union you form today is built to withstand any and all challenges. Through sorrow and joy, failure and success, despair and triumph, your bond will persevere, kept, kept afloat by the everlasting love you share. With the vows exchanged today, you will both finalize this promise and begin a new life together. We finally made it. You know I'm not much for being corny and or lovey-dovey, but that does not hinder the fact that I love you with my whole heart and always have. We have some funny origin stories. We met at a bar that neither of us wanted to be at. Bowie ate all of your food on our first date when you came to greet me at the door. I asked you to be my girlfriend with a ring pop, and finally asked you to be my wife with a completely different type of ring. We've been engaged for shortly under two years, which seemed like an eternity, but our life, our time has finally come. This will turn out to be an awesome night with a lot to look forward to, but the thing I look forward to the most is being your husband. I think we make a great team who can accomplish anything, and I can't wait to see how much we learn and grow together. I know we get pretty busy sometimes, but I promise to never give up on anything life will throw at us. You're a great teammate, my best friend, and now my wife, and I'll do anything in my power to keep it that way. I love you, Nye, and I always will. Anthony, I love you with all my heart. I am truly thankful that Chelsea pulled me out of my slump and made me go to the barn on Thanksgiving Eve three years ago. I remember sitting by the fire pit talking with Emily Graham, but I kept looking across to make awkward eye contact with you because I was too shy to say hi. But now here we are with all of our friends and family about to embark on the biggest journey of our lives. It's hard to say that I love you, say what I love about you, but a few things would be your sense of curiosity and your adventurous spirit and how great of a dog dad you are to the boys and even a cat dad to Lucifer. I will always be by your side through thick and thin and whatever else life wants to throw our way. I promise to always support you in whatever new hobby you decide to try, whether it's razor riding, dirt bike riding, or even monster truck rallies. I will always be there to support you and be your number one fan. I promise to always cheer you up when you get down and try to help you with whatever problem you are having. In every cornball movie, they always say, you had me at hello, but for me, you had me at wubba lubba dub dub. <laughs> I couldn't imagine standing up here with anyone else, and I cannot wait to see what this crazy journey, journey will take us next. I'll love you forever and always from this life until the next. Anthony, do you promise to share her laughter during the good times and wipe her tears during the bad from this day forward? I do. <laughs> Shania, do you take Anthony as your husband and companion? Do you promise to share his laughter during the good times and wipe his tears during the bad from this day forward? I do. Let us proceed. The wedding ring is a symbol of the unending power of love between two beings. Its circular shape has no beginning and no end. 
representing a boundless spiritual connection. The ring should be worn proudly as a symbol of commitment between you and your spouse. Even when you find yourselves apart, your rings will provide a powerful reminder of the eternal love you share. With this ring, I, Anthony. With this ring, I, Anthony. Commit my love to you. Commit my love to you. For all time. For all time. Giving you all that I am. Giving you all that I am. And all that I will be. And all that I will be. Please accept it as a symbol of my love. Please accept it as a symbol of my love. Place it on your finger. With this ring, I, Shania. With this ring, I, Shania. Commit my love to you. Commit my love to you. For all time. For all time. Giving you all that I am. Giving you all that I am. And all that I will be. And all that I will be. Please accept it as a symbol of my love. Please accept it as a symbol of my love. Place it on this finger. Family and friends, by the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church in the state of Ohio, I now form formally pronounce Anthony and Shania to be husband and wife. Anthony, you may kiss your bride. Hello everyone. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Chelsea. Shania is my best friend to say the least. Our parents were friends, so we didn't have a fighting chance to not be friends. And every day I am so thankful for that. We have many more years of friendship ahead of us. You are my right hand. You are always there when I need you. Hell, you're even there when I don't know that I need you. You're the most selfless, genuine, good-hearted person I know. Have you ever heard of the term a best friend soulmate? Well, you're mine. You're proof that God answers prayers. He knew I needed you in my life. A best friend soulmate is someone who makes you feel whole and who understands you even when the world doesn't understand you at all. You're my biggest fan, my biggest supporter. You always defend me, and for that, I am so grateful. Our friendship is full of jokes and big belly laughing. There's never a dull moment with us. I love our friendship unconditionally. It's hard for me to put into words just how much I care about you, your family, and our friendship. To me, you are more than just a friend. We have been through everything together. You are my sister. We are inseparable, and I think Anthony can test to that. You are the SpongeBob to my Patrick, and Anthony is our Squidward. Together, we are his biggest pain in the ass, and I wouldn't want it any other way. I'm so glad that you found your person. I'm so glad I've been there with you guys along the way to watch you grow and love each other these past few years. The smile he brings to your face tells me all that I need to know. You guys are great together, and I can't wait to watch and see you guys grow as a married couple and eventually into a family. I'm so glad you both have agreed to let me move into the basement. <laughs> I'll have all my stuff moved in before you're back from the honeymoon. <laughs> Enjoy. Let's raise our glasses to the newlyweds. May their marriage be full of happiness, all the love, and congratulations to both of you. To the Moors. First off, I'd just like to thank Anthony for the opportunity to be his best man. Back when the dinosaurs still roamed, his dad was my dad's best man, so this really means a lot. Growing up with Anthony, we'd always have a blast. Whether it was riding literally anything with wheels on it, helping our dads work in the garage, or driving Amy insane on rainy, rainy summer days. It still doesn't matter what we're doing to this day. It's always a great time and nothing has changed. In the time I've come to know Shania, she's been nothing but a great friend with a heart of gold. She does nothing but add good vibes anytime she's around, and she would give the shirt off of her back to help anyone. I couldn't think of a more perfect match made in heaven, and I wished him the best of luck in a lifetime of love. I love you guys. First, I want to thank Shania, Amy, Chell, and everyone else who helped plan the wedding. It was an incredible amount of work, which I believe paid off. When we first started laying it out, it was going to be a small wedding, but it didn't take long for the guest list to grow beyond belief. Shania and I are extremely thankful to have so many wonderful people in our lives. Every single person here is important to us in one way or another, and we couldn't do what we do without everybody in this room. Many of you traveled far and wide to get here tonight and took time out of their busy schedules to spend the night celebrating us. We appreciate you all very much, and we thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Now it's time to party. 
Andy and I would like to thank everyone for coming and supporting us. It's kind of crazy to think that we would still be celebrating in a pand pandemic, but here we are. I would especially like to thank my dad, Mimi, Frank, and Amy for all their help and support, making this day possible. I would also like to thank my entire wedding party, who all have surprisingly cleaned up so nicely. A special thank you goes out to my maid of honor, Chelsea, because she's the reason we are all here tonight. Fun fact about Chell, she's started all my relationships, so maybe one day I can return the favor for her. <laughs> Lastly, I'd like to thank Anthony for showing up. Again, Anthony and I both want to thank you all for coming and celebrating this special day with us. We hope you all have as much fun as we will.